Hi everyone, welcome back. So yesterday I went plant shopping and I had an absolutely epic, epic day. I could not believe the plants that were in stock. So I visited three different places in Charlotte, 10 out of 10 recommend visiting them if you're in the Charlotte area. First, I went to Black Hawk Nursery. I had not been there in forever. It was totally packed, amazing plants, rare plants, great prices. Then I visited Plant House nearby, never disappoints, absolutely amazing. And then I saved arguably the best for last because Cactus Club just opened up a brand new location uh, a few months ago that I hadn't visited yet. So I went over and visited uh, my gals at Cactus Club. I brought them a bottle of champagne and a congratulations card and did some plant shopping while I was there. And as you saw in the beginning, I had a huge, huge haul, but it's definitely worth seeing all the different plants um, because all of the different places have great prices. Cactus Club has a sale going on. It was just amazing. And it's different plants that I normally see in the Charlotte area. So I'm gonna take you plant shopping and then I'm going to share my haul at the end and what goes better with a plant haul than a nice relaxing glass of wine, which brings me to our sponsor for this episode. Now I'm sure many of you have already heard about my absolute obsession with Bright Cellars. They are a wine subscription service Service. So you get to try unique and different wines uh, every single month or as often as you want to and I'm completely obsessed I have discovered so many amazing wines I was always the person who would go to the grocery store and just get the same wine every single time because I was a little nervous Bright Cellars is great because they figure out what you like and then can customize the selections that you receive through a quiz that you take so after you take a quick seven question quiz, they match you with wines from all over the world curated to your specific taste palette. Now each box comes with wine education cards for each bottle that outlines tasting notes, suggested pairings, best serving temps, and the origins of the wine. They have a concierge team which can help with any questions that you have. Each box also improves as you rate your wines. Their packaging is recyclable, completely plastic free, and the smallest carbon footprint in the industry. The wine I'm trying today is a Sagrantino, which I'd never had one of these before, so I was really excited to try something new. By the way, this is a great gift. I would love to receive this as a gift. It's a full-bodied red. It has black cherry, blackberry, and plum, and it's from California. It's really delicious. Thank you again to Bright Sellers for giving my followers a limited time offer of 50% off their first six bottle box. Click the link in my description to get started. Huge thank you again to Bright Sellers. You know, sponsors like them enable me to do things like go plant shopping and provide all the good planty vibes for all of you. So, you know, supporting them um, directly supports my channel. So thank you again. Okay, time for some plant shopping. I'm really excited to share it with you. If you wanna see future videos, make sure to subscribe and follow us on Instagram as well. So let's jump into it, sit back, relax, enjoy. And at the end, don't forget about the epic haul on this over budget but worth it video. So I've just walked into Black Hawk Nursery and they have so many amazing plants. I mean, look how packed this place is. And uh, I just took a quick peek. Guys, look at these amazing, amazing plants. There are so many, This is, I have a feeling this is definitely gonna be like an over budget, but worth it. Cause after here, I'm going to Cactus Club. So, oh my gosh, I can't stop admiring all of these amazing plants. So first off the bat, like, the first plant that caught my attention was this beautiful one here. It's an Amedrium Silver. They have them in these four inch pots. They're $79.99. But these, uh, the more mature form of the leaves are very finger-like. So it's such a neat plant. I like, I enjoy plants that have very different leaf shapes depending on their juvenile and adult form. I just find that really interesting. Not to mention the silver color on this is stunning. Piper Crocatum 
$42.99. Those four inch planters, such a, such a pretty plant. Um, these do not appreciate being dried out for too long. Uh, it, they just don't handle it very well. I've killed two of them, so. Um, but look at the beautiful pink on those leaves. They're so, so lovely. I did propagate one and it's growing in water and it seems to be doing well with that. Then we have some homolonimas here. This is Epibolus Purple Sword, $34.99. Love it. There's some really cute silver squill. Some Cebu Blues here. The Cebu Blues are $39.99. So I took a look at this one. At first I thought it was an Aglionema Pictum tricolor. It looks so much like it, doesn't it? But it's actually a homolonima and it's homolonima camouflage, $29.99. This is a maybe for me today. Just obsessed with the way these leaves looked. I, I've considered a homolonema selby as well, but I have to say, this one is really beautiful. And they have quite a few of them, and I have not seen this plant before, so maybe we'll be seeing it, you know, come on the market a little bit now. They have some anthuriums. Uh, these are anthurium plowmanii, $19.99. These types of birds nest anthurium are really easy care, absolutely lovely. Look, they have the anthurium hybrids. This is anthurium radicans and luxurians. And they have a lot of them here and they are $16.99, Rad X Lux. Look at that beautiful red leaf. That new leaf is so gorgeous. I came across one of these recently. Um, I think it was at maybe Oakdale and it, it had sold out really quickly. I also saw this really beautiful, healthy Anthurium Clarinervium. Look at that little healthy boy, $49.99. Anthurium Fingers, such a great plant as well over there. Look, they have some more of these Anthurium, the hybrid. I just, I mean, gosh, I wish the whole plant was this color always. Look how beautiful that is. Although the, these leaves are stunning. You know, the texture of these leaves is next level. They just look like fluffy pillows are so cute. They have some crocodile ferns. I'm just kind of glancing around over here at their Hoya section. Looks like they have Macrophylla, Princess, Hindu Rope, $39.99. For the Hoya Carnosa Compacta. They have um, some carnivorous plants down there. Uh, Hoya Chelsea. The Hoya Chelsea's are $41.99. Look at this beautiful alocasia. Alocasia colocasia, sometimes I get them confused. I know it depends on how the leaf points. Oh, and this is an interesting alocasia as well. Oh, look at this one. This one's a little bit different. Take a little peek here. Alocasia boa, $28.99. I like those petite leaves. Some more alocasia. Oh, look, they have a Curtisii hanging out down here. How much are the Curtisii? You know, it's hit or miss with this Hoya. Mine kind of does okay, and then it goes into a slump. These are $25.99 but those petite leaves are just really, really lovely. Oop, here we have a bird of paradise. This one is orange, and you can tell because the leaves are smaller, and then it also usually has a little bit of orange. The ones you us usually see, like the really big leaved birds of paradise, those are the white, uh, white form. Look at all these plants. Okay, I love it here how they have it set up in different sections. So now we're coming into the ficus section. Um, looks like there's a little ficus umbrellata here and a ficus tenacae, ruby, um, triangularis. These little guys are cute. I love these little triangularis. $19.99 for the four inch. Have some fiddles hanging out, looking absolutely beautiful. And also this place is amazing because they just have really cute planters. It's been so long because it's a little out of the way for me, but I love coming here when I can. Gorgeous money tree. Look at this staghorn fern. 
Beautiful. Just taking a quick peek at their planters. This one that looks like wood but is ceramic is nice. So lovely. They have some Raffidophora decursiva or the dragon tail. These are $22.99. Mine grows so fast and the fenestrations came very early on. So that's a great plant. Um, looks like another little Anthurium possibly. Really pretty begonia. I like the planter that it's in. Peace Lily. They have some jewel orchids, $19.99 for these gorgeous jewel orchids. Always an interesting section, just um, checking out the philodendrons here. Let's take a peek. We have some Monstera deliciosas, and there's a goldie eye here, kind of mixed in. $24.99 for the goldie eye. Look at these huge green philodendron leaves. I wonder what kind that is. It doesn't say exactly what kind, but it's $39.99. Wow, here's another one. Look at that. I love the shape of these leaves. Definitely a big jungle plant. They have some beautiful Adansonii, $19.99. These look like they might be um, Golden Goddess, and then there's some Prince of Orange down there. These look like the Green Princess philodendrons that I've been seeing around. I was told that they did have some Pink Princess, but they recently sold out of them. And I have been seeing um, some nice Pink Princess around the Charlotte area. If you're looking for one, definitely recommend checking out some of your local nurseries. Um, Dwarf Adams, $16.99. Such a cute philodendron. Looks like they have some fuzzy petiole over here as well. Absolutely massive staghorn fern. I wonder how much it is. You know, I feel like I would do better with the staghorn fern in a planter like this. I mean, it's not their like most favorite way to be planted, but I could just handle the watering better than say something like this that's just in sphagnum moss in there. Um, just because it dries out so quickly, I, I have trouble keeping up with it. Some little skindapsis and pothos mixed in here. These are 15, a little parlor palm. Have a hurricane fern, can tell by the bird's nest shape that kind of looks like a little cyclone. Fascinating. I always like to take a peek over here in this section because they have beautiful skindapsis and pothos varieties mixed in. Looks like some Marble Queen in there. Um, I mean, look at the size of that skindapsis. Beautiful. Golden pothos, jade. Lovely. It's a cool little rickrack cactus. And then these over here are 39. I don't know, I've heard these called maybe monkey tail uh, when they get larger. I'm not sure exactly what kind of cactus that are. There's a lot that look similar to each other. Maybe copper tone, I don't know. Then we have some string ofs. Lots of great little succulents over here. hunt for like the solid pink leaves. This is as close to it as I found here. $21.99. It's not quite there, but it's almost. Look how beautiful that is. It says it's hybrid red slash pink. That's oh, beautiful. Oh look, here's another one. It's almost there. Nice 
nice peperomias over here, money trees. They have a nice assortment of ZZs. They have the Raven ZZs and the ZZ Zenzies. With, these are the Zenzies, which is the more compact dwarf-like ZZs. So cute. Some nice little whale fin ones over here. Snake plants, 49. Lots of great plants here. These are all $14.99 for the four inch planters. Here we have Calathea orbifolia. They are $19.99. Beautiful leaves, oh, just stunning. Looks like they have some white fusion Calatheas here. Uh, $22.99 for the fusions. There are plenty of fern varieties. Just notice these begonias with this tip on the leaf and uh, from what I understand that's pretty uncommon and is um, an interesting variety. I've only ever seen one like this at um, Cactus Club. So I'm curious to know what kind of begonia this is. And these are $14.99. I was just admiring the succulent. It's so cool. Look at the size of these leaves. It doesn't say what kind it is, but it's amazing. This is one of my favorite spots in the Charlotte area. So cute and fun. You can build terrariums. Um, I don't know if they still have wine, but you could have a glass of wine while you um, make a terrarium or do your plant shopping. It's just a, such a neat concept. Uh, but they always have a great assortment of plants, so I thought this would be the perfect place to stop by. Just taking a quick peek, they always have different size plants and their planters aren't uh, you know crazy expensive so just gonna kind of see what I can find here so we have $45 for a uh, Rapidophora tetrasperma <laughs> this little cute unicorn planter is adorable this is a cool plant I have one of these and it's so easy it's a really beautiful great plant then we have uh, they have some ZZ's and theriums let me see how much. These are $15 for the smaller size plants. This, um, they have a raffid for a decursiva, $30 there. Some micans. Let's take a peek at these beautiful micans. $35. This is a nice, a nice pot. Lovely pot. Um, they have so they do have some smaller micans here. The smaller micans, those are 17. This is a great plant. Um, it does not like getting too much light or being dried out too much though. Looks like a little baby string of hearts. How adorable. Looks like some more ZZs down here. Neon pothos, such a cute little snake plant over there. Let's see what else. They always have such a great assortment. Calathea cochina, this one is 16. How beautiful. This is an interesting skindapsis. It doesn't look like Exotica. Um, maybe it's Argraeus. The Silver Dragon is 48. Dracaena Florida Beauty. Another nice Alocasia. Gosh, these Silver Dragons are really stunning. I mean, look how white and vibrant those are. Little Tiny Dancer, Alocasia, $18. Gosh, I'm just jamming out. Hard not to dance while I'm filming. The music's great. 
Uh, Philodendron Cordatum, $20. Marble Queen Pothos, another little Raphidophora um, Tetrasperma, $20. It's a good deal on that. You know, and I don't have one of these anymore. And they're super fast growing. There's a lot of plants in there as well for 20 bucks. That's a maybe. Um, looks like they have a Pearls and Jade or an Enjoy down here, $12. Again, they're their pottery is so cute, $25 for that. I just bought it a Philodendron Pink Princess. Again, I've been seeing these around the Charlotte area. Look at that half moon leaf. <gasps> so beautiful, $75. Some really lovely Adansonii. You know, this was one of my first plants I ever started with and it's never gotten old over the years. I love it so much. If you're newer to houseplant collecting and you want like a unique looking plant, um, that's great to have in the home and easy to take care of. Adansonii, it'll never get old. Some Peperomia Hope, it's such an interesting Peperomia. It's so succulenty with those thick leaves. Ooh, this is a crested cacti. See these from time to time in the big box shops. There's um, a form which is a monstrous form which I kind of have my eye out, but this is $12. I don't know why, but that's like that's tempting me a little bit. Here we have some more Pink Princess, $75. It's nice to see ones with um, some nice variegation, especially when you're paying those prices. And because uh, these can be prone to reverting, so it's always nice to make sure it does have enough variegation on there. What else do we have going on? Marble Queen again. Some Marantas. These are prayer plants. Then we have a Homolonema. I believe this one is Selby. $37 for the Homolonema Selby. Oh my gosh, look. It's a variegated Hoya Carnosa Compacta. $37. Hmm. That is a maybe. I know in other places in the country you can find them everywhere, but just not here. Wow, stunning bromeliad there. And then Ethereum, oh, beautiful Sebu Blue, just hanging out. Um, look at that begonia. Oh, it's so nice, and they're growing it in water as well. some fun plants over here. Look at this stunning Monstera Peru. She's big, $85. Love those thick leaves and just the texture of them is so lovely. Look at this blue one. Let's see, $11. So cute. Perfect little cover pot. Hmm. Look at those little ones down there, the snails. This is a great place to buy some gifts as well. You know, some little souvenirs for somebody. Who doesn't appreciate a little plant gift, right? They have this section over here, low light tolerant plants, and they have some great varieties here. They have a lot of snake plants. This green snake plant is really nice, the silver flame. Some nice ZZs, great low light plants. Skin Dapsis. So over here we have some pet friendly plants. I love that they have them listed here for anybody who has pets like I do. Have some Calathea, Parlor Palm, Ponytail Palm, Pothos, little Marble Queen over here. Cute little Peperomia Frost, Money Tree, Hoya Macrophylla. 
Look at these cute little baby whale fins. Oh my gosh. $20, adorable. Lovely Monstera Peru. These are listed as beginner friendly plants. Uh, this is a beautiful plant, although I have struggled with it. Ooh, now this plant on the other hand, I believe it's a Hoya pubicalix. It might be a gracilis. 10 out of 10 recommends for beginners. These are huge pots of it as well. They are $44. I couldn't stop like staring and touching this alocasia. It's called alocasia jacqueline. And it's like really interesting texture. And they are uh, $70. Have some cute little lipstick plants over here. Fabulous, fabulous, amazing plant. <gasps> it's Alfredo. I have this guy. How much is he? Oh. $18. Mr. and Mrs. So, so cute. Little Hoya rope over here. $18. This Cebu is looking mighty fine. Some more Adansonii. Brazil over here. Wow, look at these huge um, Adansonii. They have trellises, which is really nice. Then they as I mentioned, have a whole other section over here where you can build terrariums. So they have all of these really lovely um, terrarium plants. And I'll tell you what, you can you can find some good varieties in their ter um, terrarium plants. So it's always worth kind of taking a peek, seeing what you can find. Um, and then you have your options to pick from all of these different, uh, you know, vessels for your terrarium. It's a fun place to come with friends and like, you know, make some terrariums. I did spot these beautiful Aslani eyes. Um, they're really nice size and they are $30 for the Aslani eyes. I remember when these were hundreds and hundreds of dollars, so I'm like starstruck every time I see them. Uh, they have some other Hoyas here, absolutely beautiful, gorgeous large jungle boogie. There are so many amazing plants here. Look at wow. this space. Oh, that's awesome. They have done such a good job. It looks so great. So first off, I'm just gonna take a little peek in here. This room gets really, really lovely light. So you can tell they keep a lot of their cacti in here. They, it's so nice to see all these cacti. They have such a lovely assortment. Um, they have the variegated uh, mosaic I think it's like mosaic variegated. This little variegated guy is 17. And they have astrophytum. I'm just, look at this little astrophytum with all these like tiny little speckles. $18 and then they have ornatum, $16. Oh my gosh, so many amazing plants. They have a beautiful um, euphorbia. White ghost, this one's 58. They have another one over here and look at these gorgeous white stripes. They're absolutely massive. <gasps> Incredible, this, this guy's really neat as well. $26, insane. Hoya obovada, $58. You can see some of them have like a little bit of, um, they almost look like carry eye. Look at this one, it's like perfect for $10. Some more Astrophytum, 16. Oh my gosh. 
tephrocactus, also known as pine cone. They have a booby cactus over here, $38. They have some nice plumosa over here, $15. You normally don't see them that large, or I haven't. Oh, but you know, when I first walked in, they have this begonia that I cannot stop staring at. Look at this stunner. It's this variety, it's $42. I cannot get over the pink on those leaves. They only have two of them, oh my gosh. I'm obsessed. There's so many plants here. This huge Florida green is 85. Absolutely stunning. It looks like a Monstera Pinna Tea Partita. And that one is 48. Beautiful Goldieye. Look at these lemon lime marantas. Oh my gosh, they are stunning and they are $14. They have a ton of variegated marantas. I cannot get over how beautiful they are. Look at this leaf. Wow, this is just one plant. That is insane, $38. What a great deal on that. They also have some smaller ones. Beautiful, beautiful leaves. Up here is a mix of, uh, say, bipenifolium for 32, and then the red emerald over here are 28. They always have the best assortment of philodendrons here. Philodendron Royal Queen, they are 28. They have some gorgeous Birkins in here, $13. Look at these begonias, wow, these are so, so beautiful. I'm obsessed with the shape of these leaves. I can't even, um, you guys know the person they get their begonias from is famous for her, her begonias, $14 for Demetrios. Have some cute little Hoyas here. Caria variegated, 39, Macrophylla. Here you have an Opavada, looks like Opavada Splash maybe. Just Op Opavada, 15. We can see some cute little speckling happening there. Philodendron Mykins, 14. And Philodendron Summer Glory, 42. Uh, Diffenbachia Reflector. You don't see this one very often, $17. And then over here, Plowmanii. This Plowmanii is $29.50 amazing the larger and more mature these leaves get the more silvery they get on on the leaves some more silver stripe just hanging out in the sunlight here living their best life 38 dollars there are some variegated uh, million hearts and these are 16 dollars um these are the numelaria variegata 18 Cebu Blue, some beautiful Jungle Boogie, some Homolonimas over here. These are Selby, $8. Absolutely huge Anthurium Bird's Nest. These are Big Red, $48. This Anthurium Fingers is so beautiful. And then back there is a huge Painted Lady. Now they did just ha recently have a greenhouse sale that was this past Saturday, um, but they're going to continue it through the 16th. So you'll see some of these plants have um, discounted prices, you know, that will be through the 16th. Then also on the website, they have 20% off right now, which I was just told about and I just think that's amazing. So here we have a beautiful philodendron Esmeraldans, 178, but it's on sale right now. 150 gotta love a good plant sale All right guys here we have a squammy uh 42 on sale right now for 32 and beautiful jewel orchid 24. look at this little cactus garden stunning again some more of these amazing begonias i can't stop looking at this guy he's just like the perfect fall begonia i mean the colors the little fuzzies so cute I wonder what kind it is. let's see Brad Thompson, $7. Mm. Then here's a Philodendron Gigas, it's 42. Some McDowell Chunks, 48. You can see they're about to put out some absolutely beautiful leaves. Philodendron Goldie Eye, 
uh, Hoya Obovada. These little guys are $6. An interesting peperomia here. Look at the lime green on the outside of those leaves, $10. Some more beautiful begonias. I mean, look at this one. That is stunning. Begonia Raja, 32 in this four inch pot. And then these are Begonia Chloristica, 32 on sale right now uh, for 20. Here we have a Florida green, $15 right now on sale for this guy. That's insane. Lots of beautiful painted ladies, which has actually turned into one of my favorite plants. Uh, I wasn't expecting it to be so such a great plant when I bought it, but it has been a pleasant surprise how amazing it is. $60. Now I'm so curious about this philodendron. I mean, look at these lush new leaves. This is the summer glory. 54, I've never seen this philodendron before. I wonder if it's a hybrid. It is the uh, Floriosum and the Macaulay. Oh, so this is um, a hybrid of Gloriosum and Macaulay. Wow, guys, that's amazing. Here we have another beautiful philodendron. Look at this leaf. A nice little cutting here, Atapoenzi and Bietier. $38. Oh my gosh. How am I going to choose all oh, so many amazing plants here today? Here we have a gorgeous philodendron white princess 185. Look at this stunning anthurium over here. This one's 30. Looks like a gloriosum and it's 128 on sale right now. A uh, hundred. Can we just take a moment to appreciate this stunning Thai Monstera Thai constellation? Seven hundred. Absolutely massive. I love these little shinkling guys. These are Dishidia. They are. Um, it's a hybrid. Look at it just climbing up here. Fifty-eight. Monstera dubias. Sixty-eight. Looks like there is a Bietia here. Yeah. Seventy-two. So beautiful. Florida Ghost, 135. This is a really neat philodendron, philodendron tripartite, and it is on sale right now for $25. That can't be right. Is that right? Oh my gosh. What a cool plant. They have this stunner here. It's Bietier Ataba Poenzi, um, and it's 150. I mean, look at this plant. It's so beautiful. <gasps> These leaves. I see some cuties in here, um, some silver dollar. Mine's been putting out a ton of new growth. So let me start with the plants that I got from Black Hawk Nursery. It was really hard to choose because there were there were so many plants I wanted, and there's one that I'm still thinking about that I might go back and get. But let me show you what I did end up grabbing. So first up, this was the first plant that I saw when I went there. Da -da -da. This is the first plant and it is a Homolonema camouflage. I legit thought this was an Aglionema Pictum tricolor when I first went there. I was so surprised. I was like, oh my gosh, it's an Aglionema Pictum. Nope, it's not. It's a Homolonema camouflage, looks just like it, $29.99. And you know, those Aglionema Pictum tricolors are fussy plants. So I'm hoping that this one is more laid back. This one was $29.99. It has a bunch of different plants in there. I mean, I'd never seen this one and I was, I had my eye out at the other shops for it and uh, Black Hawk was the only place that had it. It's beautiful. I mean, in person, so in person it has, you know, these super, super camouflage leaves. It's very, very vibrant. 
I literally had never heard of this plant before, so I don't know if uh, it's newer or I'm just an older lady now on YouTube and I'm not in the know on everything, but. So the other plant I ended up getting is this beautiful, beautiful begonia. It's a type of cane or angel wing begonia. The tops of the leaves have this like really interesting point. It looks super healthy, $14.99. I just thought that was such a great deal. I love the little polka dots on this plant. You know, this one's a little bit thirsty. The leaves are curling. It's looking a little wilty. So like you can see here, like look at this leaf, it's definitely thirsty. So I'm gonna give it a good drink and then if it gets leggy, you know, if it's not getting enough light or all of the leaves at the bottom of the cane start to drop off and it's too tall and leggy, you just trim it, boop, trim it. You can trim it all the way down and it'll come right back. So these are great plants. Um, I don't hesitate at all to trim them down because I know they'll bounce right back. So I'm really excited about my haul from uh, Plant House. I just got one thing from there because I knew Cactus Club was coming up and that they had a, they have a sale going on through October 16th, I was told. But I got two things. I got a planter and a plant. And I'm obsessed. So you guys know I have alf I call them Alfredo, but you can find these planters around at different places and it's like Mr. and Mrs. So I have to come up with a name for her and I don't know why I keep like Sally keeps popping up in my head, like Sally and Alfredo, I don't know. Um, I don't think that's a very good name. So if you can come up with a name for her. So I ended up getting this crested, uh, crested cacti. I'm fascinated. I've been wanting one of these for a really long time. I thought it looks cool with her, just like she has like a funky do or something like that, a <laughs> neat hairdo. She's just so cool. And I can tell this cactus is thirsty because it's getting a little puckery. If you can see, I just did a cactus care video, care guide, because I love cacti. I'm super, super into them, so. That's one of the ways you can tell, because cacti do appreciate a drink. You guys know I like the weird looking plants. I mean, that's old news on this channel. So she's real cute. I'll let her hang out with her husband. It was so hard not to walk out with like 45 plants at Cactus Club. I was just blown away. I couldn't believe this plant is tw was $25 at Cactus Club. It's huge, and I have never seen it anywhere except for Cactus Club. She's so beautiful. I love the three leaves and she's so mature and beautiful. Um, I just think this is such a, such a beautiful plant. Again, I couldn't believe it was only $25. So lush, if you have any experience with it, let me know. I can tell she's already wanting to climb. Such a neat plant. I'm not, uh, maybe these leaves are already adult form or they're, they're, they will continue changing, we'll see. I'm so excited about all of these. Da, 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 da. This is a philodendron atapoenzi BATA hybrid. And I got it for $38. Look how beautiful, I mean this leaf. Look at this leaf. It's amazing. Um, it's rooted, so I just have to make sure, cause it's a small plant, like it has a small root system in there. I'm just gonna make sure I don't let it dry out. So I'll have it downstairs where I can keep an eye on it. And you know what actually looks kinda cool with just the one leaf for now. Uh, but it'll be so exciting when little babies start to pop up. Look how stunning this leaf is. And look at the back of it. I didn't even realize this in the shop. The back is purple. It's purple on the back. You don't see that all that much with philodendron. Sorry, I just need a moment. I'm like really into this. It's so beautiful. If you have any suggestions, again, let me know. I really want this one to do well. This next one, in addition to that plant, this one really caught my eye. Look at this crazy amazing begonia. She is so beautiful. I have wanted one of these forever, forever, forever. This is a Breviri Mosa, and it's, it was $42. It's absolutely beautiful. I'm definitely gonna have to propagate this one and just try to make more of this plant because this is literally my dream begonia. My dream begonia. I love it so much. I am really getting into these pink plants lately. I don't know what's going on. That's one of these things as plant parents, there's like all of a sudden we're into something and it changes. 
So whether it's a Hoya or it's, you know, camouflage plants or pink plants. But right now I'm like wanting pink Aglionema and a pink Begonia. So I don't know, there's some cool pink ones out there. So I have one more little cactus club. I'm sure you guys can guess what it is because I'm nothing if not predictable when it comes to astrophytum. <laughs> you know I had to grab an, an astrophytum. They are my favorite type of cacti. There are so many amazing varieties. I mean, look at this guy. You know, you see all the spots on there. That's actually um, spines. And it's so cool how they just adapt. And look at it from the top. It's amazing. And I like to collect astrophytum. And they take a long time to grow. And this one, uh, is a really big one. It was $16, which is a great, great price. I'm just obsessed with Astrophytum, and this one is no exception. Astrophytum Ornatum Metztitlan. Thank you for putting up with me and letting me share all my hauls and stuff with you guys. It's really nice to have a plant community to share it with. And if you have any care tips, definitely let me know. I do try to post once or twice a week, always good planty content. So if you want to see those future episodes in your newsfeed, make sure to subscribe. And we also have an amazing plant community on Instagram. So don't forget that Bright Sellers is offering 50% off your first box of six bottles. And if you're interested in that, click the link in my description below. All right, everyone, thank you so much for watching. You will definitely be seeing me soon. Have a great rest of the day. Bye.